Hey YouTube and welcome back to It's Amazing. If you are new to my channel, hello, my name is Caitlin. How are you? Subscribe. And if, and if you're an old subscriber, like welcome back Terry, we've missed you or like I've missed you. So, if you are new to my channel and this is your first time seeing this beautiful chocolate face, do not forget to subscribe. Like, we are almost at 700, which is almost at 1,000, which is what I'm trying to hit. So, if you see the red button, make sure you make it great and subscribe and join the Terry family. Like, join the Terry squad. We don't bite. And if you want to see the inside scoop and more of this beautiful chocolate face, follow me on my social media accounts, which will be listed up above just for you. And... Yeah, like I'm excited. We're about to try a new product, so let's get right into this video. I do my hair toss, check my nails. Baby, how you feeling? Hair toss, check my nails. Baby, how you feeling? Okay, so by the title, you already know what we're gonna be using, but I'm just excited because we're gonna try the main choice today. I know this is old to y'all, but it's new to me because I'm just now spending money on it because they had a sale. And what a sale they had, 80% off. Can we just talk about that for a minute? Thank you, Main Choice, because like, your girl couldn't get it without the sale because y'all pinched these college pockets. Besides the points, I am going to be using the, hold on, I'm missing a product, wait a minute. <laughs> Sorry girl, I thought I was missing a product, but she was just, <laughs> she was just sitting behind me on the bed. False alarm. So today I'm going to be using the Main Choice Tropica Moringa line and like I'm so excited y'all because I'm always looking for the next Bex product to handle this special type of breed. So I am going to be using the entire line which is six products. They have a shampoo, a conditioner which is rinse out or leave in. I'm kind of confused about this one, not gonna lie. Like if you can rinse it out or leave it in, is it really conditioning? But next product. Then we have a mask, a sealing cream, and a braid out glaze, which I'm kind of excited to use, and restorative spray. So I'm going to be trying all of these products, and you are going to watch and see the results. And I'm also going to be doing a braid out for the first time. Like, I'm terrified, but. We will, we will see what we can get. I've been watching tutorials on braid outs. I think I can do this. I think I'm gonna have faith in myself and I'm gonna think I can do this. So you will be coming into the shower with me today. So let's come on. Okay, so we are in the shower and no, I am not naked. <laughs> so before I begin, you know, show you the shampoo. So I'm gonna start off by saturating my hair with water and make sure I get all of it, you know, wet, soaked, you already know the drill, like just wet your hair, weigh it down and get her nice and juicy. And I weigh my hair completely down before I put an ounce of shampoo in it just so like it can be easier for me to get to my scalp and so I can clean my hair much easier. All right, now that I like a character of somebody's scary movie, let's proceed. I'm gonna start by sectioning off my hair like I normally do. Then I'm going to grab the shampoo. And now this shampoo is supposed to help to support natural growth and retention. It's ultra moisturizing and cleanses without stripping. Now she was kind of thick when um, I took out thing, like as you can see, like she's kind of hard to get out the bottle. But we get her out and we put her on the scalp and on my hair. It's a little squeaky, but it doesn't feel like all the moisture is gone. Probably in my ends because they're just trash. But like up here, it's feeling pretty nice. Okay. <laughs> now I'm going to be going in with the Tropical Moringa Sweet Oil and Honey Endless Moisture Mask and it is for curly, wavy, and the kinky hair. And she was kind of thick, I'm not gonna lie, she was thick when I got her out the um, container, but I don't even explain what I'm feeling. I'm just gonna let you guys know in the end. Just watch. <laughs> but yes, I'm gonna section off my hair and apply the mask all over my head. And I did detangle with the mask. It was kind of it had, it had some slip. She was just a builder though. Like we had to put more on her, more product in order for it to be, you know, as slippery as I like it. 
but with, along with water she worked you know she worked pretty nicely and she clumped the curls so I'll give her that Okay, now that all of my hair is masked up, I'm going to be putting a DIY shower cap <laughs> on my head and leaving that on for some time. Okay, so this is 10 minutes later and this is how my hair is looking. I'm just going to rinse this out and start with the conditioner slash leave-in slash pudding slash tax refund. The consistency is a little under medium thick because I can still feel the water in it but I know you all see how she defined the curls in that section. So I put it all over my head and got my wrinkly butt out of the shower. Okay, so here's my hair with all the deep conditioner, no not deep conditioner, all the leave-in conditioner in. And she's looking good, like I may have gone ham with the leave-in because I want my hair to be moisturized. But yeah, I feel like it worked. So now I'm going to begin this braid out process and I am so scared because I've never done a braid out. I just don't want to put all this time in and then for it to be ugly. Like that's what's gonna make me mad. But let's just continue anyway. We're gonna do this together. We're in this together. <laughs> okay, so here's the section that I'm going to be starting on and the directions on this, which is what I was going to use next. It said use the mister before. So I'm just gonna, you know, be um, respective of my products and I'm gonna do what she says. I'm gonna use the spray and then I'm gonna use the cream. So this is how the spray bottle looks. She is eight ounces. I'm gonna just take it and, okay, it doesn't feel oily. It just feels, it feels like water. That's weird, but okay. But you can't even see anything, but yeah. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with the sealing cream. And this says it is supposed to help to support natural growth and retention, and you know I need that. And it says it's for curly, wavy, kinky hair. So that's about all of us. So let's see how she works on this special breed. This is how the product is looking. She's not like thick, thick, thick. She's like medium thick. Now I'm just gonna take that and put it on the side. Ooh, I like how that applied. <laughs> nice I don't know I don't know how I feel about that it applied nicely but like I don't I don't, uh, I don't know I'm probably just I don't know my hair is I don't know so <laughs> so I'm just gonna do all of that all over my head I'm going to spray the spritz stuff first and then I'm going to put the sealing cream on all over my entire head okay so here is my hair with the sewing cream and the oil on it with well, the spray restorative thing just feel like it's not going into my hair let's just proceed maybe maybe it does this and it sinks in later I, I don't know so for the final product that i'm going to be using today is the tropical moringa pearly braid out glaze now i have never used anything like this so we're just going to see how this works like i'm kind of excited to use this oh this looks pretty I don't know if this is my, no, it's not my imagination. I can see. It's like, I can't show it to you. I don't want it to spill over, but it's like it has like, I don't know, it's, like, it's not glitter, but it's just shiny. I don't know. Some sparkly stuff in there. And it smells like the rest of the line. This one, this scent is kind of more muted, like the leave-in and the mask, which I appreciate because, I don't know. It's just, I can't get into scents like this. They're just not my, that's not, they're not my thing. So I'm gonna start off with like sections like this of the glaze. This is how she's looking. It's reminding me of a less thick um, Gorilla Snot. So this might go well. And I'm just gonna apply it to the section. Could this be a wash and go type gel? Is it strong enough for that? Hmm. Feels good though. This. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I have the section detangled and I'm just going to plait like regular. I'm just going to get three pieces, try to make them as equal as possible. And then I'm just I'm just gonna plait it. Like I'm just gonna plait just regularly. Just get it. I might plait ugly, I'm sorry, my hands are weird. I don't even know how to show you. 
I guess I'll show you a closer up thing of what I'm doing when I get up to the front because I ain't gonna be able to show you. Okay, so I know this is a braid out, but I'm not gonna braid my hair all the way down to the ends because that's gonna be too too much. I'm just gonna twist pieces that started getting too small. I'm just gonna twist it up and twirl it at the ends. This is my first plait. Like, y'all see these inches? I'm, I'm <laughs> But yeah, this is my first plait right here, right here. And yeah, I'm just gonna keep going, adding, applying the pearly glaze donut stuff and just plaiting my hair down and twisting when I get to the end ends and then twirling. So yeah, sit back, relax, and enjoy this non-copyrighted music. So my phone decided it wanted to die while I was recording, but you know, that's, that's okay. We're, that's cool. I am done with this full side of my head and I have, I have 12 braids over here. And so, yeah, like I'm just going to braid the other side of my head and like this is taking so long. I cannot see why people like braid outs because twist outs, I can just and go, but this I got to it's really irritating but I mean we're going to persevere and I'm going to do the other side off camera because storage matters and I'm not trying to use all of my storage so yeah I will see you guys tomorrow will it be tomorrow I'm not sure let me see yeah I'm just gonna be back in the morning okay capiche I'll see you guys tomorrow Okay, so I am back and I'm not going to even tell you it's the next day because it's not. I've had these braids in for like four days. So they better be dry. But it's like these are so addicting. Might have found just a new protective style because these are just, excuse the acne. <laughs> because these are just so addicting. So these are the braids. They're looking real juicy. So let's just get into this takedown. So I normally take down my braids, no, my twist outs <clears throat> with my oil blend. So I'm just gonna do the same thing because I don't want this to be frizzy. So yeah, I'm just gonna take, you already know the drill, like if you see my tutorials, you know, put it on each fingertip and get ready to take down. This is about to take so long, I can feel it. <clears throat> Okay, so I have the first braid down. And like, I know y'all see this definition. Like, I think I'm gonna like it. I'm gonna be mad because it's gonna take me a whole year to take this down, but this is cute, no? Yeah, yeah, right? Okay, so I'm just gonna take down the rest of them the same way I did this one, applying oil to my fingertips as needed. And yeah, like you guys can enjoy some uncopyrighted music. 
I won't be afraid to If I gotta choose me I gotta do what I gotta do When I love you, I lose me Now I can't be attached to you no more I like me better when I wasn't yours I'm going back, I'm going back I'm going back, I'm going I'm going back, I'm going back I'm going back to who I was before I like me better, I like me better I like me better, yeah, yeah I like me better, I like me, I like me better when I was yours I gave you all that you asked me You like the view from behind Okay, so this is the first half unbraided in comparison to this half. And you wanna know what's crazy? Like, I don't even feel the need to separate anymore. Well, I mean, I can see places like right in here, but I don't even feel the need. Like, it's at a good, it's at a good bounce range. <laughs> is that weird? Like, do all braid outs have this effect? I don't know. But if I were to separate, I'd do it just like a twist out. I just get it, you know, right where she needs to be, right where she naturally wants to separate. I gotta find and control this looks right here. So I don't think I'm gonna separate. I'm just gonna separate the other half off camera because this is taking a long time and storage matters. So yeah, I'll be back with my final results and I almost forgot that I was doing a review of a product I don't know why I forgot I was doing that but I will come back with my final thoughts on the main choice Tropica Moringa collection so I'll see you in about two seconds okay so I am back and the braid out is here now I love it I honestly love it but I just don't think it looks it suits a middle part I don't know but for now we're just gonna have this middle part because I'm not about to style my hair because I don't feel like it these are my results and they looking real cute I mean for a virgin braid out girl like this this is pretty bomb I really like this and I like that I didn't even feel the need to separate that much and I'm kind of mad because I've been sleeping on braid outs for this long like what's wrong with me why didn't you guys tell me you're fake. But anywho, as you know, I did use the main choice Tropical Moringa collection for this braid out. And now I'm just gonna tell you like my thoughts on all the products. I'm gonna be starting from my favorite product to my least favorite product. And then I'll give my explanations, yada, yada, yada. You all know the drill, how review goes. So let's just get right into it. My favorite product out of this entire collection would have to be the Tropical Moringa Pearly Braid Out Glaze. Not only did it define my hair, but it didn't suck the moisture out like a normal gel would. So yeah, like I'm really into this, really into it. And shockingly, like my second favorite product from this entire collection is the restorative spray. Now, I did not expect to like this as much as I did. I really like a spray oil type of girl. Like I like my oils thick and oozing so I can slide it on my hair but like my hair doesn't feel it doesn't feel dried out and I think this played a part in it I put this on top like I felt it smooth onto my hair and I liked how it felt plus like I know y'all see the shine I'm gonna come a little bit closer so y'all can see the shine bomb and I think it was because of this but I'm all about having trash ends but them looking healthy because I put a spray on it like that's beautiful. Okay, next we have the Rinse Out or Leave In Tropical Moringa. I said it backwards, but you know what I'm talking about. The Rinse Out Conditioner slash Leave In slash Detangler slash whatever. I was actually like confused with this product because I don't even like I don't even know what confused like it just messed up my wash day. That's what I was kind of confused about her. These two, like you could have given us a leave in. And I would have been okay with it because you have a deep conditioning mask. But it was the best product moisture-wise. For me because I felt it sink onto my hair like do you get that like you, you get it if you're natural I end up buying this again probably not because I have a leave-in that I like and a conditioner that I like but I mean it was it was cute it was cute it wasn't just it wasn't horrible but again like it wasn't something I gravitor 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 gravitate towards <laughs> if I saw it in a store. Okay, fourth on the list would have to be the shampoo. And like, I'm, I guess I'm placing it at fourth because it's, I'm not, like it's a shampoo. Like, it wasn't anything wowing about it. It was just a shampoo to me. 
but it did not leave my hair stripped and it felt squeaky clean which confused me again because like how are you not gonna strip but you squeaky okay fifth on the list would have to be the mask now when I hear mask I think of like deep treatment deep you know moisturization like I need you to medicate my hair but this didn't do it for me like even when I first put it on I was just like I was so underwhelmed like at how it felt on my hair like it didn't just didn't <laughs> it didn't do anything for me basically like <laughs> and then I had to pile it on to even make it feel good on my hair so that's like a no-no because like I'm trying to save money and I'm have to use double the amount of product like how is that going to save me money I'm gonna need it to have some mask qualities I'm gonna need my hair to feel like butter when I rinse it out and it just it didn't do that for me and last and least is the sealing cream now I did not like this at all I really don't have anything good to say about this besides the smell because like all the products mixed together I know I say I don't like strong scents but when I did my hair and I had those braids in my head and I was just you know leaving them in like when I caught a whip in my hair I was just like <sighs> beautiful like I didn't like how it felt on my hair I felt like it sat on my hair and I tried to add more water and everything but all that did was just activate the conditioner well the leave-in conditioner conditioner I don't it just activated that and I felt that more than I felt this I, felt, I don't feel like it just sunk in and moisturized it that's why I don't know I just don't I just didn't like it I didn't like it like and then it says it's a sealing cream but it's not that thick I like my sealing creams to be on the thicker side and Something that I know will just penetrate my hair and just, you know, keep the moisture that I put in. But I feel like this wouldn't even, this wouldn't even do that. Like, moisture is seeping out as I speak. <laughs> so, yeah. So, yeah, those are my thoughts on the main choice, Tropical Moringa. But that does not mean that you cannot try it. So just don't take my word for it and just run with it down a track. So if you feel the need to try it out yourself, I mean, go for it. Would I buy this entire collection again? No. Would I buy the braid out glaze again? Yes. <laughs> try it for yourself, you know. See if you like it. Because like I said, she's a special type of breed. And she needs, she needs, she needs help. So. <laughs> but yeah, that is the end of this review braid out <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video if you did enjoy the video do not forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe like I spent money for one of the first times and yeah like you should subscribe and if you want to see more of my chocolate face do not forget to follow me on my social media accounts which is listed up above just for you and yeah like the one good thing that did come out of this is I know I like braid outs now so <laughs> If you like this braid out, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.